Welcome back to Nippert Stadium where Orange and Blue training has wrapped up on a rainy Friday and FC Cincinnati about set to host Charleston in what should be a huge match tomorrow night, 7.30, here in the Queen City. Tom Gladder, happy to be alongside my broadcast partner, Kevin McCloskey, as we get you set for the second meeting this season between the two clubs. It was five months ago today the USL season opened and Charleston hosted FC Cincinnati. Hard to believe that was five months ago, Kevin? A lot, yeah, a lot's happened in that time. Obviously, both teams have went on good runs. Um, obviously, FC Cincinnati are in first place, Charleston in third place. So, sets up for a, an interesting game on Saturday night. Well, 1-0 win for FC Cincinnati on Sunday night, the three-year anniversary of the club against Penn FC. A change that night as Patty Bart stepped in at center back for Deco Canon, did a great job and earned Player of the Week honors. Great moment for him, I think, as well, just with that performance. Obviously, given the uh, captain's armband as well, shows a ton of respect from Allen to kind of initiate that as well. So I think a young player like Patty has continued to improve this season, and hopefully we get to, to watch him play maybe on Saturday. On well, the potential to see a boost offensively for Allen Koch as well. Emery Welshman back from a three-match suspension. He acknowledged this week that he'll probably be involved in the 18, and that should certainly give the forwards an extra option. Definitely, and I think for him, you know, he, he, he got banned, obviously suspended. Um, it takes a lot of patience to kind of react the right way for that. Uh, and credit to him, he, he's worked his tail off in practice, uh, continued to work hard and, you know, stayed focused, gets his reward again on Saturday, and hopefully is the difference maybe to play against this Charleston team. FC Cincinnati opened all three of their seasons in the USL at Charleston. They lost a playoff match here to the Battery. It's a club that's never lost at Nippert Stadium. How much has this developed into a rivalry the last three years? It really has. You know, you talked about the last last year's playoff game, especially. I think that that still hurts uh, a lot of people within FC Cincinnati. I think Charleston have a, a lot of confidence coming into this game too, with that stat never losing at Nippert Stadium, which really has been a fortress for FC Cincinnati. Um, both teams are very, you know, impressive runs, both double digits as far as unbeaten streaks. So it's going to be a really interesting game on Saturday night, and probably a lot of fireworks. Yeah, no doubt. And there'll be fireworks after the match as well. It's a 7.30 start. If you don't have your tickets, get them now at fccincinnati.com. Kevin Lindsay and I will have the call for you at 7.30 tomorrow night. Can't wait for it. Thanks for tuning in.